Hello. So you're doing a PhD, and now, finally, after months, maybe even years, you've managed to finish all of your experiments, do all of your calculations, and you finally got your results. Now, managing your data can be a very time-consuming and difficult process. And despite it being a very important part of a PhD, many people don't understand the importance of presenting your work in a clear, efficient, and professional manner. Over this course, we're going to give you an introduction of how to manage, interpret, and finally present your data in a way befitting of a PhD student. Hi, I'm Roche. I'm a third year PhD student here at the University of Surrey. I'm studying nuclear theory, and I need to be able to evaluate my simulations using clear and informative plots. Over my part of this course, I'm going to teach you to use Nuplot to create your own very concise, and very professional looking graphs. Hi, I'm Vidas, and I'm a final year PhD student here at the University of Surrey. As an experimentalist, I have to deal with large data sets, analyze them quickly and efficiently. I will be covering the Origin 8 and MATLAB part of this course, and I'm hoping that me sharing my experience with you will help you to produce publication grade figures as well. So our x and y axis uh, are the rows and columns, and the colors representing are the values of the matrix. Okay. Um, and once again, the same exactly exact commands like x label, y label, etc. are used.